Fluid sex with the now constant use of masks in public required by the state of the Connecticut, supplies of masks and other PPE can often be stretched a bit thin. And that was one reason a local immigrant organization decided to hold a PPE giveaway. This was in North Haven. Channel 3's Mark Robbins has that story. They were lined up to hand them out and receive masks and hand sanitizers along Washington Avenue in North Haven on Saturday morning. The Bangladesh Society of Connecticut organized this event, which planned on giving out close to 600 packets of masks and sanitizers. The reason? Need is up. But we're seeing a downfall of people getting masks, hand sanitizer wipes, or just overall PPE protection. So my family and my friends that I call family now decide to host the event here at the most convenient location ever. Everyone gets McDonald's on the Saturday morning. Here you go. Thank you very much, Thank sir. You no problem. And sure enough, the cars poured into the parking lot in a pretty steady stream. Some people surprised, while others were alerted to the giveaway. My wife called me, asked where I was, and I told her I was uh, heading to Dunkin' Donuts, and she said, stop at McDonald's. The town is running an event and uh, giving away hand sanitizers. Not so much the town as the area. The Bangladesh Society is a true statewide group that feels a sense of common good that it wants to share with everyone in Connecticut. The Bangladesh Society of Connecticut decided it was a good idea to give back to the community, the community that wants to give back to immigrants, and we want to show that immigrants are also Americans who want to give back as well. I really wanted to thank everybody for doing what they're doing. You know, I don't think people get enough credit for uh, a lot of the volunteer work people are doing. Well, everybody considers this a terrific success, so much so the group says if you hit them up on their email at Bangladesh Society of Connecticut, at gmail.com, they might just come out and do this again in your community. In North Haven, Mark Robbins, Channel 3, Eyewitness News.